guys, this is just with your surprise, surprise, surprise. So we're looking at each sign to see what you may not be expecting and what could possibly be a surprise for each individual sign. So let's get started. Aries, some of you, I feel that there's changes. We have been seeing a lot of changes going on with um, Aries, uh, kind of putting the gauntlet down. So some of you are definitely changing up some part of your life and it may cost you mm -hmm. some of you may not expect that you're gonna have to cut a check pay a bill um write off um some items if you're filing taxes late you may find that you owe money you're going to get a far back you're going to get back far less than you expected you may even get a, a letter in the mail um, about money that you owe that you don't expect to um, receive or you don't expect to have to pay is what it looks like. Others of you, that there, there can very well be that you're making some decisions and, or you have and you're no longer giving to two. You may decide that you're cutting someone off. The money supply is cutting off or uh, money is being cut off from you, okay? And some of you may feel like this is not the best time it could happen because you don't feel um, in your right state. Some of you may feel like you're, you're powerless over the situation, so you have no power. You really kind of don't know where to go with the situation. How do you get yourself out of it? Uh, so it may you may feel like it's going to be a bit of a burden. You may feel like the remainder, for some of you, it could be um, the next 10 days for some of you that you feel it's really a burden. You could even go up for the next two months until we get into a uh, Leo season that you may feel as though um, it's going to be up here hill battle or it has been for some of you but there is a lot of reconciliation when it comes to finances and I do see a lot of Aries being surprised either of the amount you have to pay the fact that you have to pay um, or the fact that you're having to make a decision um, that you some of you may not necessarily want to make it's out of your control um, or you're not taking it as well as you possibly thought you would. So some, again, some change either by force or by choice that has to do with finances uh, or an overall having to take a step back or being um, cut off is what I see for some of you. Uh, that may prove to be a bit challenging for you overall. So that is a surprise that I see for Aries. Now on to Taurus. Taurus, your surprise is that you or some of you, I will say, uh, will definitely be surprised by some things that's coming out. Okay, this could be happening to you or to someone else. But someone will probe, question, um, almost inter interrogate to some extent, wanting to know um, why. Why? Someone wants to know why. They need to hear why. They need to hear you say it or you need someone to say it. Now, this can be in any area of your life, uh, but you need to know why you were rejected, why this isn't going to work, why did, are you getting a no. There's some information that you're either being turned down or it's unfavorable and you need to know why or someone needs to know why. And I feel like some the person that's probing, it's not going to relent they're not going down without a bit of a fight and a challenge uh, because someone can no longer hide um, the end of a situation. Someone can no longer hide what's blatantly obvious. But instead of those little, someone is probably putting out um, clues or you know being distant, that sort of thing. Someone needs to hear it. They want to hear it. They need it verbally. They want to know 100%. So you don't love me anymore. Okay, so you don't want this anymore. Okay, so we are getting a divorce. We are moving. You want me to move out? Okay. Someone needs to verbally say it to make it real is what I get. And that's going to be the surprise. Um, either you're not prepared to hear that or someone else isn't prepared, even though whoever whoever's asking, um, they may be... Con concluding that they already feel that way I feel because it may have been given to them subliminally so it's it doesn't even have to be with love it could be that you probably already knew because it took so long to get back to you about a job so some type of yes you're anticipating turns out to be a no but you really want to know it could be again turned down for um, a home loan or getting approved uh, also getting um, 
your offer approved, something when it comes to tangible, concrete, committed situations that are coming up as a no and someone needs to get down to the bottom of it. So the surprise will be either hearing the no or discovering why this is happening uh, for some of you Tauruses. Now on to Gemini. Gemini, uh, so your surprise this week is that there's some lesson that you're going to learn that's going to cost you. Okay, it may it may be because of the family. It may um, the the lesson you learn may affect your family. Okay, I do see that some of you are going to be really worried. Um, you may have did something, and for all of you, it would be different or something. It doesn't have to be that you did it yourself. It could be because of a family member that they did something and now you're paying for it. You're ca kind of caught up in it too. It's going to physically cost you money, but I also feel like the lesson itself is going to cost you. Um, it may um, it may make you feel like you have no win or you you can't fight this off. Right. And I do see some Geminis being very worried that a situation isn't going to work out because of a cycle that repeated itself or a lesson that was not learned, right? Um, I feel that a lot of you will learn this lesson, whatever this is, but it doesn't come without consequences now. So there there could be some consequences. It could be physical money that you have to pay to make something go away. Um, and you still won't be too sure about the outcome, if that makes any sense. So the surprise for a lot of you Geminis that can resonate with this will be a lesson learn that it's going to cost you and for all of you will be different um and it could be you know in a most mundane sense you have to you know you thought you were going to graduate this semester and it's like actually no i'm not and now i have to pay for yet another semester or i have to get a tutor or i have to you know pay for an, an extra course to learn a b and c so something would be literal um and it could affect the family because again it throws everyone's all everyone's timing off of of when they were going to come so it can kind of affect the family not just you and it is a lesson learned of how did you lead up to this place so again it could be very mundane in your everyday life or it could be a huge major um life lesson that's going to cost you that will bring stress it affects the family for some of you it won't be negative effect it will be the family is there for you to fall back on um and it also I see is something that you should have, you have either no wins in, you can't fight this. So you really have just have, you just have to do what you need to do to get out of it. Um, or you have to see it play out um, is what I'm seeing here. So that may be the surprise for some of you is the extent of the lesson that you'll learn or the extent of the circumstance that you're going through. It may be because again, like I said, if it affects more than you. Um, the, the amount of money you have to pay out, um, or realizing that this could have been avoided had you did things in the past differently, but now again, you're learning some kind of a lesson. So that will be your surprise for Gemini's now on to cancer. Okay. So cancer. Now I'm going to read your surprise in two different ways. So it will possibly resonate with two different groups of you. Now for the first group, some of you, your surprise is going to be that, um, you are happy because things are working against someone in your life. Things are working against them. Whatever someone was trying to manipulate, trying to do, uh, to you, is turning on them. They're not able to do it. They're not able to manifest what they want. They're not able to, um, they're losing money. So if they try to take money from you, they're the ones losing in the end. Um, if they was wishing bad on you, bad is coming to them. Um, you know, they may have thought that you were in a bad place and you stressed out. Now they're the ones that stress out. That's for some of you, okay? And that's gonna be the surprise of how quick the will has, how, how quickly the tables have turned. That would be your tagline if I was doing just a reading for, for um, cancers. It would say, it's so, sh how quick the tables have turned because it literally is like night and day. Like you guys have gotten your happy back and that's a surprise. And you may even get news word or confirmation. So some of you in this group, you would know because some kind of way you would have a bird's eye view confirmation that 
this person's life is kind of upside down and you're doing just fine. Okay, the turn tables have turned and that will be the surprise because you can't really believe it that it happened to the extent it's happening or as quickly as it has happened because again, you have your ebb and flows that or things were just really not going so well for you. Now, that's the first group. For the other group, the second group of you, it is that you are in a good place. You feel like everything is falling into place and things are okay and you're fine. But you're going to be surprised at how quickly things change and it's not going to be for the good. And I do feel like that lies for whomever has done things that is unethically sound, perhaps have not done things that's that's good, you know, um, manipulated people, stole from people, you know, did things that karmically they are going to have to deal with some type of retribution so if hopefully that's not you cancer um because i do see it as a second group of you guys it definitely can work out that you're really happy about things but the surprise is, is that enjoy it while it lasts because the tables are getting ready to turn on you as well but make no mistake about it the tables are about to turn and there's going to be a huge surprise to the gravity and to the extent that they will turn so hopefully you are the one that is only uh, an observer <laughs> in this whole situation. But it looks like it's going to be a huge surprise coming up this uh, week. So now on to Leo. So Leo, I do sense that some of you, you want to make sure over the weekend that you are crossing your I's, dotting your T's, that you have every little nuance and insignificant thing taken care of. Go shopping, um, whatever that you may wait to the last minute to do, do it because you're going to find that this coming week, the huge surprise for you is that you're going to be ridiculously busy. Things will come up out of nowhere, one thing after another, and you're going to, you know, work feverishly to keep everything, stay on top of it, to keep it in control, keep it in alignment. You are going to be surprised at how quickly things have changed, meaning how quickly you may be agitated. You may find that you blow up at people out of nowhere. You may find that, I feel like it's more you guys since you're carrying the seven of wands energy. Uh, you may find that because you have so much going on, so many people are expecting something from you. All of this stuff is coming out of nowhere that you're back in this place that you kind of can't get yourself out of. OK, some of you, if you're at the gym, if you're working out, you may be surprised that, hey, I didn't lose any goddamn weight this week. Like I actually I actually put pounds on and it's stress um, for some of you. So there's going to be some surprise at just how quickly things are coming at you, how much demands are on you, how frustrated, easily frustrated you're getting. Um, how you can't seem to get yourself out of something is going to be surprising too. No matter how much you try, how hard you work toward it, how many people are involved, how many avenues you go, you just feel like this isn't going to work. And that's going to be a huge surprise where perhaps you thought that things were going to work out. In fact, you feel like there's not amount, there's not enough um, there's not enough amount of work um, strategy that you can apply to get yourself out of something. And that is going to be a huge surprise. Be very careful because again, I do see that you can, you can feel e e mentally frustrated, aggravated, angry, upset, um, stressed out. A lot of tension is what I'm seeing here as well. Um, I, I think if you don't exercise, this would be an amazing time to do that because you need some somewhere to um, get rid of that negative energy. You know, okay, and a lot of it from you guys is people coming at you and think everything will seem to come at you at once, or it could be something huge that hits you, and it takes everything you got to try to you know get this under control. Just be aware that it may be a shock to you or surprising that no matter how much work and energy and effort you put into it, you're literally in quicksand going nowhere fast. So now on to Virgo. Okay, so Virgo, um, now I have to say it, I'm going to say it, I'm going to say it, I got to say it. There's a few things here some of you may feel as though it doesn't resonate. If you do feel like it and you like, only if you like to share, please do so because I really want to know if this fits with some Virgos out there because it's very specific what I'm saying here. Now, as you can see, your card is a chariot, but there's more to this chariot that meets the eye. I feel that some of you Virgos 
are, and it's so weird because it literally is tying back into that cancer reasons reading. So if some of you are dealing with cancers, pay attention because you may realize that this cancer was never who you thought them to be to begin with. I do see that some of you, and this is and this is what I'm hearing. This is what I'm seeing. So I'm going to say it. Some of you are you you're doing your best to keep you know your poker face. You feel like you know I'm not going to let anyone see me sweat. But deep down inside, you're you're going to be surprised at how much you you do not have love from a person or particular group. You feel like you, some of you are going to have to put, put your tail in between your legs. Some of you are going to have to eat crow. Like you're walking with all of this power and I don't care, but it's following you everywhere you go. You can't run away from the fact that some of you have no love anymore from someone or a particular group. You know, the, what you're used to having, you don't have anymore. Your power is not at its on full staff anymore, like full flag. It's not there like that. Um, or someone is a force to be reckoned with. And some of you, if you have a cancer in your life and you've been going back and forth with this person, if now, like this coming week, they don't surprise you of the power that they have or how quickly things have changed for them, by the time we're in cancer season, it's going to be like, whoa. I think a lot of people are going to be surprised by cancers, you know, on a, on a whole, but for Virgos, it's going to be like, wow. So be careful. Now, others of you, I do feel like some of you are going to be like, <laughs> somebody may look at you and be like, or you may look at yourself <laughs> like by yourself. You may say, you know, you don't fucked up, right? You know, you don't fucked up. You know, you don't fucked up, right? <laughs> somebody might be either looking at you and saying that you may be realizing that about yourself or you Virgo could be looking at someone and saying that, you know, you don't fucked up, right? Yeah, you know, fucked up. <laughs> Somebody has effed up. Someone has definitely um, is being left in the lurch. It's like, listen, you know, fucked up. There's no coming back for this. You know, you know, fucked up, right? <laughs> Somebody is going to either hear that or know that, or it's going to be confirmation of that coming up this this week, and that's going to be the huge surprise. Whether you realize it for yourself. Um, or you see that with someone or they say it to you or it's just a look that's confirmed like, yeah, somebody fucked up. This is what I see here, most definitely. And that is going to be your surprise that somebody done fucked up. Now on to Libra. So Libra, for some of you, your surprise is going to be, be careful. You may be getting duped this week, okay? That may be your surprise if you have plans to buy a car, pick up a car, get a car fixed, be very conscious and maybe delayed. Um, they may tell you that they have to go back and do A, B, and C just to upcharge you. Uh, if you're going specifically at a distance for work, uh, something may happen at the last minute. You get a call, no, you're not, they have to reschedule. Actually, they're going to go with another candidate. Um, they found, they, they did your background check and no, they're not going to move forward with you because you have some discrepancies. So, some of you may have had a plan to go on a trip. The trip doesn't happen. So there's something about moving forward, movement or actual vehicle that surprisingly is not going to go as according to plan for some Libras. Um, some, again, plans I see more than your actual vehicle being put into place that things did not go that way. Uh, some of you, again, and I'm getting this for a lot of signs, surprisingly, you feel strong about moving forward in, in one aspect of your life, but deep down, things are not panning out the way that you want it to be, and that is the surprise, and that seems to be the theme for a lot of people, so it'll be interesting to see what the weeklies look like, but again, for Libra, surprisingly, I do see that moving forward um, isn't going to pan out the way that you expect it to pan out for you this week. Now, um, some of you, again, because you may not even in communication from someone, it literally like, oh, we were planning to do A, B, and C, and the person just disappeared. I don't hear from them anymore. I don't know what the hell is going on. And then you hear from other people, oh, this person lied to you. You're going to, you're going to, whatever the secret is, you're going to find out the secret. Okay. Or someone may double back to you and tell you why they didn't contact you, why this didn't go through. So whatever the problem was, you do find out about it, all right? And for some of you, the surprise may be that once you find out that someone lied, manipulated, uh, whatever the story was, is when you decide to say, okay, I'm done. And it may not be in the week 
coming. It could very well be in cancer season that you decide to completely cut someone off. Um, but this will be a defining moment. Surprisingly, the information that you're going to get now um, will change your direction in some kind of way. So that will be your surprise. Now on to Scorpio. Okay, so Scorpio, um, now your surprise is going to be, um, for some of you, the surprise may be not making a decision at all. Some of you may feel like you should have made a decision by now. And the fact that you still can't make a decision may be a surprise if someone has yet to make a decision when it comes to you. And your surprise may be that because a decision hasn't been made, if you've been waiting for one, you're going to decide to leave. Okay. Some of you, you the, the surprise will be that, that after holding off for some, so long, you're going to leave. Your, your plans are going to change. Where you thought you were going to go, you're not going to go. Okay, so for some of you, the, sh the surprise will probably be to other people that you're going to walk away and you're going to leave and go someplace. And someone may not have seen it coming. You may have mentioned it and they didn't really want to deal with it. And they're like, okay, fine, whatever. And now the days come and it's kind of a surprise of like, what? You're leaving. And you're like, well, yeah, I did tell you this a while ago. And he's like, well, I thought you changed your mind, you know? And it's like, well, no, I'm actually leaving. So there's going to be some, some kind of surprise that you guys are telling someone that you're leaving. You're moving on. You, you're not going to do A, B, and C. Um, and again, if you're dealing, you if you're saying this to an, an air sign of someone who's not as emotionally open um, or maybe more emotional, emotionally guarded, they may not have been prepared to hear this and they may not be prepared to hear it until you they actually see you leaving out the door like, oh shit, you actually did leave. Okay. So that will be the surprise that Scorpios are leaving, leaving something. It could be for all of you, obviously different, but either someone doesn't want to deal with that reality. You've yet to completely um, conclude it for yourself for some of you. Some of you also, you're, you're, you're leaving, but then you may stop yourself. You may already have said that, yes, I'm leaving, I'm moving, I'm doing this. And then you stop yourself 100% and say, actually, I'm not going to, I'm not leaving. Yeah. So for some of you, it will be a, a moving, moving and leaving. You may say on second thought, I'm not going to do that. Um, for some of you, others of you, you're leaving. Okay. And someone else is not prepared for that to happen. So definitely surprise would be some movements, moving, moving on, leaving a situation, not being ready to do it, but surprising yourself anyway and doing it. Um, others of you going against the plan to do just that and holding off of a plan to move, move on or make a decision. That's going to be your surprise. Now on to Sagittarius. Okay, so Sagittarius, you too. Uh, lot, seems like a lot of signs are having this one to two group reading. Um, so you two also having like two different groups. So the first group of you, um, you may have a huge surprise that you discover that your relationship is ending. Somebody's moving out. Someone's moving on. The love isn't there. The love hasn't been there for quite some time. You've not been able to see eye to eye. And the person just kind of could just move out without you even realizing it or stop speaking to you like cold turkey and you don't see it coming because you could have just been like, well, la, 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 like everything is fine. The person has never made mention of it or they've covered it up pretty good. And now it's like things are coming out. So that's one way I'm seeing um, this group that it's just like something it's, and some of you also can get news from someone, but Okay, so there's three groups. The first group of you, the surprise is going to be that you're going to break up with some, someone's going to break up with you and you may learn that the love hasn't been there for quite some time. The other groups of you, you may be feeling like you're getting more stable. Life is pretty good for you when life is starting to be bad for someone else and they may have a hard time not showing it. Um, I just guess someone could be seething, very angry, very upset over the way things has the way things has happened between the two of you or what all has happened like you, they may feel like oh you've gotten favor and now i have to pay for things so i just get someone may not be doing so well while you're doing okay and that may be the surprise as well almost like that cancer reading that i was mentioning too um the third part of it 
I feel. And I also want to say check up on your friends and your family um, that may be of water energy, air energy. Um, they may be going through a bit of a rough time not telling you. There's some things that people in your life that are they're, they're either not telling you because they don't want to open up or they feel like you're the cause of it. And they secretly like I'm talking this person can't stand you. That's what I get secretly. <laughs> So somebody is just really not opening up to you or they feel like you're the cause of their problems is what I'm saying, okay? And you may be surprised at just how much this person really has disdain for you is what I'm saying. Like very clearly for Sagittarius, you're surprised. It's like how much a person either has fallen out of love um, or has disdain for you because of what they're going through. And again, you may have had something to do with it. They may, it may be all be in their head, but that will be a huge surprise. Um, for others of you, though, you're going to get a wish. You're going to get a, a huge wish, something that you've really wished and wanted, you're getting. And for some of you, it may be both, right? You may come to realize that, oh, something is going on with this person and I'm getting my wish all at the same time. <laughs> so it could happen like that. But for some of you, the surprise is going to be a huge surprise getting your wish getting a huge yes feeling happy once again feeling stable feeling like everything is all the pieces are falling together and again i just feel you may get one to two wishes like yes yes two big big things something to really celebrate just really feeling blessed and really feeling like things are falling into place so enjoy 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 that is going to be your surprise. And again, like I said, for some of you, you'll be both. It'll be, you know, experiencing that realization with someone um, and also getting this wish, you know. Others of you will just be the wish and others of you, it'll be that situation with that uh, outside person. Uh, so good luck with that, Sag. Now on to Capricorn. Okay, so Capricorn, after some time of thinking, much time of thought contemplation you're going to leave all of you it's going to be different it may shock the person or people they may have already seen it coming eight of cups is something that you know it it, it has happened over time it's not like the, the, the tower card so you're going to leave a situation you've put a lot of thought energy and time into something um also some of you you, you could be leaving because someone has been non-responsive for quite some time and they're not going to do it. So guess what? You'll take one for the team. You're going to leave. I do see surprisingly Capricorns will be leaving something or someone's going to be leaving Capricorns. But I do feel like you're going to be the one making the decision to leave a situation 100%. Um, and it has, I feel, a lot to do with the full moon that's coming up, which does square you. So it's going to be a tough situation. Is Whatever you're leaving, it's not going to... Um, it's not going to be great overnight. No, you will have worry, Capricorn, about this. Some of you ha may have already been worrying a lot about leaving. After you leave, you will be stressed out and worried a lot. Your anxiety will kick up several notches having made this decision, okay? But I feel like the full moon in Libra is probably forcing you with that square, forcing you to, to take charge and to do something. And you know that there really isn't a, a perfect door you can go through, but you're gonna have to do it. And you, you may surprise others and you may even surprise yourself to take this leap in such an unknowing way you know direction you really don't know how it's going to work out and it will it will bring you stress worry and anxiety sleepless nights and all those things it will but i do feel you know fear fear you know fear or not ready or not you're leaving okay you are going to leave and that will be your surprise now on to aquarius so aquarius your surprise is definitely an end of a situation and you're not happy about it you're not um if you're dealing with water energy, they may not be happy about it, but I feel like this is more coming from Aquarius's. Some of you may be shocked and surprised at how much this end is affecting you. Um, it may affect your everyday life. It may be a situation where um, this end, it, it's not over because you still have to like um, settle things. Some of you may realize how much you have to pay out to something. Um, it's not going to be, you're not going to be happy. Whatever it is, if it's involving you having to pay out something, you're not going to be happy with how much you have to pay. But now it's, but at least it's going to be over once you do that, right? Uh, if it's money that you're anticipating, it's not going to be what you expect, but at least you're going to get something and now it's over. So there's a part of you that's like, okay, it's over, but it's not without 
disapp huge disappointment, feeling taken advantage of to some extent, and being unhappy about the results. Okay. Um, so yeah, this is not the best week, you know, as far as like what you can expect as a surprise. Um, but I do feel like whatever this end is, it'll be better for you to, in, a, in the long run, it's a good thing. It needs to happen, right? But it just sucks right in the moment. And I feel like for some of you, you may be shocked that it, again, how much you have to pay out. Um, you're thinking you're going to get a certain amount. It's like, oh, I'm not gonna even going to get what I thought, nowhere near what I thought I was going to get. Um, and some of you may may come to a realization about a particular someone in your life, and you have to be the one to say, "I'm I, I'm not going to do this anymore. I'm not happy. I'm putting in a hundred. You're giving twenty. This is just not going to work for me. It's it's that type of thing. Needing to make a decision or a decision being placed upon you by by be it by choice by force that you're you're surprisingly. <clears throat> what you hear, what you discover, and thus the decision that's made will be very surprising um, and not one that um, will feel good is what it looks like. It's not going to be, it's not going to feel very good to have to um, go through this process, but it does get you to the end of this particular situation. So now on to Pisces. So Pisces, some of you are going to be surprised that you may have to sacrifice the first part of, of it. It looks like there's a sacrifice that's going to be made um, in a love relationship or in a contractual agreement, okay? That comes quick, comes very quick. Some of you, you may d decide or it be decided upon that there's a divorce that's imminent. A breakup is happening. A commitment is coming to a close, Um a traditional way of doing something is not happening anymore, okay? Um, and this doesn't make you feel happy, okay? Uh, now, this can be some type of institution that something comes to an end with an institution. There could be some not so, not so great news when it comes to institutions. So that could be school. That could be anything institutional um, in an institutional way. If you're looking to get into something... Um, be an institution, you may find surprisingly this week that the news, the news is good, but it doesn't come without some type of a sacrifice, right? So you have to lose something to gain. <clears throat> you may be able to get into school, but you can't get in until a certain time. You know, you may have to pay out something. Um, yeah, I do see waiting. So there's some news that you're wanting or something that you want to happen now. Surprisingly, you have to wait longer or guess what? You're not going to get it at all. It's blocked from you. So you're not going to be able to get something. Um, so surprise for Pisces either. Again, whatever this is, you're going to have to give it up. It's going to be blocked from you. Uh, you can get it, but it's going to be at a cost or it may be delayed. Okay. And that will be the surprise. So there's going to have to be some type of adjustments um, that needs to be uh, accepted really when it comes to a specific way of something being done for all of you and uh, and for some of you. And for others of you, there's going to be a, a divorce that's coming. Um, and even if you're in the process of a divorce, it's going to be some type of delay. It's not happening the time frame you thought it was going to happen. And it may not be the best news that's coming out, but there will be some type of um, delays or something you know, completely doesn't work out. And that will be the surprise for some of you Pisces, okay? So that's what I have for you guys. I hope that this has been helpful. Again, this is just a little peek at some uh, some type of surprise that some of you can anticipate for the coming week. I find it to be very helpful. Um, and it's a good way to kind of circumvent situations or at least lessen the blow if it happens to be not most favorable news uh, so that's what i have for you guys again if you like there should be no reason that anyone is time stamping you do not have to time stamp i'm putting the time stamps in the um it should be in the um the comment section i, I have to pen this thing i have to find out how to pen it but so you guys can see it if not it'll probably be in the description box i'll put it there too if i can but i, I definitely should be in the comment section so no need to timestamp this guys 
otherwise, I would love to hear your feedback. If you feel it resonates, how did you particularly um, take the reading for your sign uh, overall? And if you would like something personal with me, I can be reaching the beginning and into this video as well as in the description box below. And if you are new to this channel, welcome and subscribe because I will be back very soon with another one. Take care, all of you. <laughs>